Hello and welcome to a Minecraft tutorial on how to double and even triple your frames in Minecraft 1.16.4. This is a very simple and easy tutorial to do. We're going to load up a normal Minecraft instance just for reference on frames, so on and so forth. So this is going to load up here. It's so easy to install this. So here we go. Here is the Mojang Studios. We're then going to go into single player. We're going to create a world. It's going to load into the world as normal. Like so, loady, loady, loady. And done. We're then going to see this is a normal world. If we press F3, we're currently getting 60 frames and it is capped at 60. This is due to Z Z-Sync. V-Sync, so we're going to turn off V-Sync and we're also going to turn the max frames to unlimited here so we can actually see what we were getting. So we're getting 200 frames, I'd say, 160, 230, there, thereabouts. I've got a Ryzen 3800X using a 1060 graphics card, so it's going to help pretty much anyone no matter what system you have. So what we're going to do is we're going to close down Minecraft and now we're going to do the fancy bit, we're going to install the mods. So you want to go to the first line of the description that's going to take you to this fabric. You're going to want to press download installer. Make sure it's the EXE. Press download. It's going to download here. Then what you want to do is you want to go to the place where it's downloaded. So mine is in downloads. We're going to want to double click on it. And it's then going to run the install. Here's the install. So what we're doing is we're going to, it's going to be on version 1.16.4. You don't need to change the loader type just leave that as is and it's going to create a profile in the directory where minecraft is installed so i'm going to press install that is now done if we reload minecraft up here oh sorry when it's done you'll get this window here it's been successfully installed many mods also require at fabric api in the mods folder we do not need it for what we're going to do but that is just an fyi if you do need it for certain mods so once that's done, we can minimize it. We can now see here, we've got Fabric Loader 116.4. We're gonna press play. It's gonna load up. I'm gonna bring Minecraft over here from this screen here we go. So we were sitting at like 160 frames, 170 it was going to 230. That, it was kind of jumping about all around the show. We're loading to exactly the same world. I'm gonna press F3. And we're at like, it's actually got uh, 200, 170. It's, it's flowing about there. So then we're going to options, and you'll see in video options now that everything is just as normal. Nothing's changed. So we're going to now make these frames jump higher. So we're at 260. 260 seems to be the ballpoint. 220. That's fine. We'll close the game down. We're then going to go to the start menu. I'm going to type run. I'm going to get this run here. In here, you need to type percent app data percent. Okay, you then want to go into Minecraft. Then you want to go into a folder here that you see mods. There's nothing in this folder. Then go to the second link in the description. That's going to be sodium. You'll see here it says sodium Minecraft 1.16.3. Now, this is fine. Don't panic. Download the 116.3. It's going to bring you to this page. You're then going to wait two more seconds. Mr. Beast is going to be there. And then it's going to download. Make sure you press keep. That's going to download and all is good. Then you want to go into your downloads folder again. And you'll see here that you got fabric installed that we used before. And now we've got a new one called sodium. Basically what you want to do is drag, drop sodium into this mods folder. That you opened up. You then close them both down. You then want to reopen Minecraft back up. Make sure it's still on the fabric loader on the drop down menu. It should be. Press play because Fabric was the last one you used, so that's why it'll still be there. It's going to load up Minecraft again. Bring it over here. So we were saying 170, 220 frames. Now, if we press New World, New World, sorry, we're going to we're going to load the world that we were just in. So we're back in now, Minecraft. We press F3, 450 frames, 680 frames. So basically, if I move about it. We, I think it's fair to say that it, the frames have actually tripled from 220 that was peaked to now 700, 800 frames. And that's just for installing one mod and it's literally taken, what, just five minutes on this video now? 
You can look up in the sky as well if you want to see how high it goes. It literally goes to 1,300 1, frames. And that's all you have to do. That's it. That's installed. And now everything. It'll even load worlds quicker. If I press create world and just create a new world, it goes from zero and it just just loads them up. It does actually load quicker, I promise you. <laughs> but I do think that there will be a slight hit due to the fact I am recording as well. But here we go. We're in the jungle biome. 500 frames straight off the bat. Doesn't matter which world you're in. All seems to be fine. 600 frames. You look at the sky, as we know. Getting 1,000 frames. So, yeah, that is, that's literally all you have to do. It's taken, what, six minutes, this tutorial done and you've tripled your frames with one mod two installs that's all you need to do uh if you need any help feel free to join my discord the link will be in the description or put your comments in the comment section if you need any help and i will get back to you as soon as possible if this has helped please leave a like let's do the bigger youtube thing please leave a like as it helps a lot to get this video around when there is new versions i will do updates to this tutorial but this is for 116 point four there's some turtles there's 600 700 frames that's all it is that's as easy as it is and i'd like to thank you for watching and i will see you in the next tutorial